we're back in the forest. Happy Saturday morning to you all, unless it's not Saturday morning for you, in which case I feel bad for you. But I don't feel bad for my lovely hot cup of coffee. Okay, where were we at? We needed to grab a bunch of logs. We needed to start finishing up that. Needed to start finishing it. That, yep, no, that, that's good words. That's good words and stuff. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's do it. Oh, running out of running out of the old stamina. What do you oh, what? What? What did you put clothes on? Did you oh. Who knows? Who knows what you're gonna get? Coming to work every day in a forest? Come on now. No. Well done, bro. You cut down that tree like it was no one's business. You got this today. Don't just like disappear into the cliff. Oh. All right, so far so good. So so fresh, so good. It's getting dark. Nice, nice, nice. Don't even look at me, bunny rabbit. Don't even look at me. I'm thinking, do we build a zip line from there? That's what I'm thinking. Thinking a question to myself, do we do that? That's what I'm thinking, that's what I'm pondering. Um, out well most of the logs are fairly well behaved great no 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 I swear to god not right now bro okay just I'll shot you in the neck uh okay Ugh. Some fighting animation you got there. No, guys, I'm trying. Look, I, I, I apologize. I was trying. I didn't want to fight. Don't, don't break my things. 
I don't care what you do to me, but don't break my things. Is that guy gonna throw fire at me? Now look, look. I'm gonna... That was a bad opening move. I was hoping for de-escalation, like someone's angry at an airport, and you just want to be like, Hey friend, you look frustrated. Anything I can do to help? But instead I was like, no, oh, I know exactly how you feel. And that doesn't de-escalate anything. I basically walked up to the cannibals and was like, Oh really? It really hurts my feelings when people deforest my forest and shoot me in the throat with a bow and arrow. I understand how you feel even though I did it to you. That's what I did. I was one of those guys. Hmm. They've probably wandered off. All right, guess got some log collecting to do. Oh, bro, you're having a rest? Oh, now the seagull's having a rest. The turtle's having a rest. Look at all the resting going on. There's no random fucking logs, just... That's a thing, right? Hey, the... Hey! Ah. Oh. Abacus... Used fish trap. It was super effective. Fuck's sake. Hold on. Remember the game, kids. Stand on the legs when you cut them off because it's screamingly good fun. Hooray! Like a Tony Hawk move. <laughs> Can you do two of the arms? Can I just. Not really. Uh, they probably won't find the head, and um, yeah, I'll uh, <clears throat> try and think of something clever to do with the. Uh, where's the really shallow bit? Oh, it's not there. I did have a post from a a fellow redditor. We we're talking about aggro of the cannibals. And that if you just leave the dead bodies around, um, the small, starving animals come to eat the big bodies, and then the bigger ca Ooh, the bigger cannibals turn up and attack them, and you just get so many bodies. And they're saying that uh, by day, like two, in game you can have up to forty cannibals just running around, going absolutely ballistic, being aggro at you for your food dryers. Food dryer, I get, yeah, meat dryer, hanging, meat, yep. Your food dryers, your campfires, which aggro and attract them. And then, of course, the dead bodies aggro them, and then they fight each other, and more people die, and more aggro. But maybe, maybe I need to make a YouTube video of how angry I can make them over how short a period of time. I feel like if you can jump and place two logs at a time, then you should at least be able to walk with one. Sorry, one extra. Three. Three. God. That's that pretty rubbish English, even by my standards. Alright, we're topped up for rocks.
You can do it. I believe in you. Oh, have I... F yeah. I goofed. The, uh... The sleep cycle, because that seems to restart when you jump into a new game. Which kind of bothers me, to be honest. Bothers me real deep, Shrek. Alright. I think we have precisely 14 logs that I need to place, which means the, uh... The log counter that was cooked in the previous previous stream has sorted itself out. That's good, because I didn't want to have to do that myself. Okay. Um. We really just need more logs, right? And that's... Something in the water? Probably not, because that doesn't really happen. That's not really a thing. Um, if it was, some peppy YouTuber would have found it by now. What about you? Are you good? Good, great, excellent. Lovely. Do we need to? No, we're all, all right. Coming up, Millhouse. Don't, don't start seagull, right? It's not the chip shop. Okay, we're up here somewhere. Ooh, can I? Surely I can just stick them under the rock walls, right? Surely, surely, surely... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, jet, but, uh, oh, okay. That feels like a no to me. Now I can place them here, but the issue is when you've got them on a flat surface, so you want to do like a platform thing, so that I can simply inject the logs a little higher. Hmm. Look, we'll just we'll deal with it for now. We don't have too many more to go. I'm mostly frustrated about not sleeping. If you don't sleep, trees don't grow back. Let's just, let's just park it there. There you Invisible tree, invisible tree. Weirdly convenient. Cool. Less convenient, but um, <clears throat> where are you, Muppets? Oh, yeah. 
Is your monstrous friend somewhere? I'm pretty sure that's the monstrous friend noise. Mm. Never mind. Hey, you fellas. Probably going to come up here and give me a hard time. I'm missing a log? What did we have? No, alright. What? No, you're not a log. That's not a log. This is a log. Um, I'm not sure if your losers are still hanging out there. Not in the mood for a fight. Just put it somewhere. That's quite a good moon. Uh, can we? Can we? No, alright. We're just gonna have to push on through, chaps. You know what I should build? because I'll be using so many of them that if I'm between rock adventures I don't know I didn't I didn't want to I didn't uh, hey I got my stick back um that one and then that one yeah nice so while I'm running around doing all sorts of other things we can at least collect the rocks, right? Not entirely sure how many of these carry, but... Was that it? Was that all the... Oh no. You cannot carry any more rocks. Build more pylons. Is it? Construct additional pylons. Is that it? Build more farms. You need more Vespian gas. Alright, alright, cool. And uh, 13 logs. Mouthful of coffee, pardon me. Mm. No, just, just, just go away. I don't want some quasi... We, we had a moment across the shore and we realised that we're both human deep down. I just... Mm -mm. Just want to get my things and I really don't want you to break my boat. That's kind of where I'm up to right now. I just don't want you to break my boat. Uh, yeah, that's ideal. Thanks. Friend. Kind of more of a hassle, especially toing and froing with the logs to the boat. But it was quite the hassle when we would put them down the zip line and everything would just explode. And then you spend the next five days just trying to find the damn logs. Alright. This might not go our way. From a violence perspective, we might be on the back foot with our back to this little area. Don't get me wrong, if I was playing single player by myself and wasn't streaming, I would probably just hide during the night time. 
but you gotta you gotta bring it when you're streaming. Don't get hit by a tree, don't get hit by a tree. Oh, I think that was close too. soon yeah and it'll get really dark for a moment expect a big surprise today when you wind up with your head impaled upon a stick that's your horoscope for today yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that's probably copyright sorry weird al i'm not trying to rip off your stuff i'm just a fan More to the point. Cloth. Hmm. Precious, precious cloth. Rub it on my skin. I would actually say, despite everything in this game, and to a point you start to love the bugs, they become part of the character. The whole, when you save your game, it doesn't save, like, your sleep meter, and that just restarts when you boot back in. I'd almost forgive it on multiplayer. I think that's just because when you're in a multiplayer server, you expect more bugs. And I'm editing up a 100 heads challenge that I did with one of my fantastic followers on his server and boy did we have some issues getting that together but it's just so frustrating when the whole mechanic of the trees regrowing is attached to your ability to sleep let's, let's swap it up hey more Thanks for the cloth, guys. Uh, except you didn't you didn't give me any, so that's that's fine too. You don't owe me nothing. It's correct, like early morning, leery eyed, off to work. Correct kind of music, like this or Metallica, but. They'd probably get mad if I started playing Metallica on my Twitch stream. If Lars who bought you didn't ask. Right, I'm hoping she at least gets the floor built. Sorry, the walls built. I'm gonna put the, gotta put a floor on. And then a few more stairs, let's be honest, we'll just grab a couple more trees while we're at it. Don't dance in stream. You'll give everyone motion sickness. Drugs? Could just be on drugs. Okay, 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 alright, okay, just... 
having a thought. All right, first up. That, no, yep, that didn't work. Uh, oh, hey! Um, just lying around. Oh, comedy gold. Um, so, just sort of here, actually, on this little... It's not helping at all. Uh, or right at the top of my axe, this little outcrop here is, for the longest time, virtually the only place I would ever build. Um, I just want to see if this reaches. I'm very, very sure it does. But I want to... I want to check oneself before wrecking oneself. As we do have maximum length to these things. Although, from the other side of this outcrop, I can make it almost to the front of Katana Cave. So again, I'm very sure. But, uh, you know, measure twice, cut once. Or rather, I'm going to build it on a bit of a platform. So that hopefully I get fewer of the issues I was having with the other zipline. And although you will hit a critical mass of logs pretty early on, um, looks like there would be a good spot. All right, like bam. Cool, but we definitely reach. Right, 10 logs, not so bad. 13 rope, we'll get there. Katana Cave's just there. I think we've got... No, we don't. We'll get there, right? From an engineering standpoint, one of the most impressive parts of lighthouses is how they got all the equipment and all the materials needed to the random-ass places that they build lighthouses. Civil engineer is that civil engineering building big buildings like that or is that just regular like engineering and architecture or is it, you just find an honest to goodness tradesman and you go mate I need a lighthouse right there he walks around a little bit and then goes yeah, all right and he just tells you what's up that'll be fine Get that bit done, and that's cool. I know, you worked so hard to get the logs here to start with, and now you're starting a different project. Um, and then... Uh, a second. Fast. And then, it doesn't really matter. Come on, don't be so janky, just... Whoop. Uh, yeah, that'll, that'll be fine, thanks. Ten rope, eh? Really, we just want to smash and grab Katana Cave a couple times. Jump in, grab the cloth, jump out, turn around, go straight back in. All the cloth will return. As was foretold. That the cloth would come back to its people. And hopefully, we'll at least have two different places we can relatively easily uh, smash out 13 rope. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Bear with me chat, blowing my nose, hay fever, you don't need to hear that. A rope mission, we haven't had to do a rope mission in quite some time. It's been a while since we needed some, any real serious quantities of rope. Ten, always ten, tip top, tip top ten. Um, we 
We have Katana Cave, and then we might run into Modern Cave, which I used to have absolutely memorized like the back of my hand, but the last few times I've been in Modern X Cave, I'm finding myself getting lost. Which is precisely what I did the very first time I ever played this game. I've probably told this story a bunch of times now. First time you play, you don't know what you're doing, you die. Multiplayer wasn't even an option back then. So naturally you're on single player. You wake up in the cave. I completely just missed, just missed the bit of high-vis rope. Admittedly, was not at all looking for it, didn't know what to expect. Hadn't really seen any of the climbable rope yet. I think I crashed out near the yacht. I was trying to build on the beach. The combat mechanics are a little different in this game compared to actual fighting games, which is what ruins your expectation. Um, if you two could just like park here, hopefully we'll be back in time to get something sorted. Are you just gonna slowly walk, walk up, roll? Okay, okay, we'll just park here. Yeah, and I got completely lost in Modern X Cave, and there's quite this large, watery, open area. And like, I'm freezing, and I, like, I wander in, I can't wander out, and I'm trying to just do laps of the outside. Get out, and I'm stuck, and then there's another cannibal in there, and I don't know what's going on, I'm like, this game's wrecked. Um, and then, for such a long time, I would only ever play it and just run around on the surface. Which I think a lot of players still do, they just don't really go into the caves. You don't actually have to. Um, you certainly don't have to finish the story in any capacity at all. But it is nice to get a few of the extra items. It's just up here, right? Alright. Why don't we eat a few of these? Considering they're just all over the place. Uh, we'll smash a few things. <laughs> Looks like I've been here before. Guess we're here for the cloth. Oh, and some of the sticks, I guess. Come on now. Does the rope that's hanging, does that respawn? No, they even come back? No. Doesn't look like it. Oh well, let's uh, let's go shopping. What is that like from some game show back in the day? Let's go shopping. Come on down. Oh, mmm, mmm, right. And some of these. Alright. Right. Remember kids, if you're ever stuck, you don't have anything to put on fire. You just keep hitting the bodies. Maybe not this one. Probably this one though. And cash falls out. It's just like being a high school bully. Except, except not these ones. I, I promise you, the ones in the cave, you keep hitting them, and money falls out. I just have the rope? Guess not. No, I might. I, I promise you it's a thing. Money falls out of the corpses hanging in the caves. Thirteen rope. Ugh, what can you carry at most? Like four? Let's just... Another bit of rope. 
There's two bits of rope. And then five, six, seven. Come on. Eight. Okay, so four it is. So we'll have to do a few laps, my friends. I guess. Is that? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah, we can we can climb up this side. I think you can get around the other side too. Frighten me. Honestly. I need to wear a bell or something. Excellent. Right where I left you. Where I left you? No wires. Um, is that like three rope? Nice. I think there's a bit of rope hangs out back a chainsaw cave. Like one bit of rope maybe. Oh, hey. Surprised at the lack of traffic, although I think where you are in the game to a large degree determines how many cannibals are going to sort of run to you and, and stand around and look and then potentially get really mad at you. And sort of this top area here, that down, that lower area down there and by the beach, and then the next area up where I'm building right now. All have different paths, 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 pathways uh, to get there. So if you actually move in between, essentially semi regularly, I uh, just wander from one to another because you're jumping up and down cliffs. Their pathing changes, and you can go incredibly long amounts of time not actually seeing anybody. Okay, I'll get lost. Uh, seriously, it's a, I gotta prove this money thing. I'm sure it's a thing. Absolute. Hey, see? Cash prizes. And you just keep going. And you just keep getting cash. Right? It's just like when you'd bully a kid in high school. Hey, kid, give me all your lunch money. I don't know. Is that a thing? It's lunch money. The whole premise doesn't really exist in Australia. You just take food. Although some schools, like, everybody brings food and we can share. Come bro, you got it. Here you go. Bit of cloth. I've had this can of hairspray for the longest time. Uh, meds, cool. Don't need them. Uh, okay. Follow me, follow me. Don't get lost, don't get lost. Wander down here. And there is, I think, to the right somewhere you can go that is just an open water. I mean, I've got a map for God's sake. Yeah, okay, the maps of the caves don't really help. You do just have to memorize this stuff. So I think it's down there. It's a big watery area that leads nowhere. It's just a big open watery area that possibly has a cannibal in it. A few free sticks. Anyway, we're not going in there because that's not where we want to go. It's the very first time I ever played this game. That's where I wound up. Trying to find a way out. I think. Oh, is there rope in here? Oh. Oh. Yeah, I'm right. I'm right. You got this. I believe in you. Mm, rope and that one photo you can't pick up. Uh, so there's a little bit of rope in the modern axe cave, like the, the bit you jump down. 
pretty sure it's here, and I'm pretty sure I've cleared everything out, right? Right? Played this game so many times over and over. And I just don't trust the game at all, you juicy little thing. Don't trust the game at all. Although, like, that was because of an experience we had in Lawyer Cave, and I think we've confirmed that's isolated to Lawyer Cave. I hope this is the right one. Turn up to Virginia, ready to go. Here's Mary, my warm suit with a cigarette lighter. I'll get you my Zippo. Uh, yeah, this looks this looks cozy. Why don't we just live down here? Um, there you go. Mmm, modern arrows. Dynamite that I don't need. What am I? Oh, what next? We good. Tape. Why not? Uh, what's that? Just more. Hmm. Don't care, don't want, don't care, don't want. How many? That's another two. Oh. One more bit of rope. I'll just see if there's a few more of these little cloth containing boxes. Come on, buddy. You're wearing me out just listening to you. Where's my coffee? It's got to be a couple more, right? It's got to be. Hey, money. I was, oh, come on bro, was thinking, um, now the creative juices have started flowing recently with just how much fun I'm having on the stream. Uh, the next place we might build once we're satisfied the lighthouse is serious enough is here. I was actually thinking of making some kind of base in this cave because you can crawl in oh, through the other side, uh, which means you can bring rocks rocks. Then you can bring logs in. Is this the direction we go to get the fuck out? No, that's the direction you go to get down there. Any cloth there, though? Just have a quick scope out this way. Uh, is that the outside world? In such a long time. Used to have these things memorised. I think that'll do me. 21, that's another 3, 3, that's 6. Lovely. Let's go down that way. I think it's a bit of a rumble. Which we're not in the mood for. What about, can you. Katana Cave. Now you've got to climb down into Katana Cave. Clear it out fairly easily enough. Uh, and then, what does Katana Cave poke out onto? I think it just points out onto, um, like, there's a few other internal places. Oh, there's a section that gives you out some dynamite and sticks you out in the middle of the, the sinkhole. Which we've no interest in doing. Thank you very much. Hey, fellas. I love how you just, you spawn in when I get nearby, just to keep wobbling and freaking me out. Or when you're looking off in the distance of a cave and like, have I been here? Have I cleared everything out? And you see stuff start to move, but it's just because it spawned in. Hey! Spawned in because you were looking at it. Is that a, that's a rock. That's just a boulder. 
I like that boulder. That's a nice boulder. We'll run over here. Try not to get killed or eaten by anybody. Very nice. Didn't even break my legs. Well, hibbity hobbity, I'm building on my property. Up here. And then we'll have a little, we'll chuck a couple logs on. All right? And what I'm hoping is that the height, the height of the zip line will uh, help us not have the logs explode and go everywhere quite so much. Lovely. That weren't so bad for a day's work. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that. Nice. Oh, and thank God some of the trees will come back. Where's my little... My little stream, nine followers. Maybe we'll get to ten one day. Come on, bro. Pick up, pick. I can see you looking at it. Pick up the damn log. Must have been real hungry, bro. Oh, now you're real thirsty, bro. Great. No, 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 no don't, 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 don't. Settle down. Lovely. Lovely. Thanks very much. What is it now, like 50 days until Sons of the Forest launches, or should launch, provided nothing dramatic happens? Actually even contemplating, do I take a day or two off work and just try and do some, some serious streaming of that game? Then at the same token, do you just do what you often do with games and, and give them a week and wait for all the hot fixes to come out? Looking at you, Dying Light 2. Looking at you. Which is a game I think I'd like to stream. For me, it's it's like crafty survival games. No, 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 just pick up the fucking logs. Crafting survival games like this, uh, like Icarus. Uh, Subnautica, love it. Get in there. Uh, and zombie games. I just love the Dying Light game. Love Dying Light 2. Not as much, but I do really enjoy it. It's not quite as desperate. I think that's my issue. Oh, less a sense of being alone. And really, really vulnerable because it's like everywhere you go, there's fucking someone. Which I do get. That's it's very canon, all right. That's precisely how it would be. It's years later. It's in a big city. They weren't the first city to get zombies. I get it. I do get it. Although a little upset that some of the cool moves that they kept showing in the trailer just never happened. Um, let's rock out over here to our new zip line and just see how things travel once we start putting some some numbers down on the zip line
No, I'm just going out of my mind. Don't look at me. Don't even look at me. Oh, we could even do a spot of fishing. No. Glorious. What about the Bioshock games? They were awesome. I loved every single one of those. Don't know if I'd be into streaming them though. That kind of role play. I do see people doing it. I saw somebody streaming The Witcher. Good for them. It's not my bag to watch someone play a game like that. If that falls on my fucking zip line. And I think that's what you got to do. If it's not something you'd be interested in watching. And it's not something you've any business streaming. Because you wouldn't be very good at it. I still play Skyrim. I probably there wouldn't be much I'd actually want to stream because for me playing Skyrim is me hanging out, being my nerdy little self, um, and I don't really want to talk about it. And also, so much of the game is a grind, right? And because of that, I don't want to watch it. I'm not really interested watching anyone else play it unless they're doing something really unique, which is also usually pretty short. I wanted to. There was money going. No way I could have made that happen. Don't get me wrong, I expect these all to kind of explode and go all over the place. I just want to see how bad... how bad the damage is. And away we go. Mm, watching, watching. Yeah. Okay, okay. I mean, not as bad. Right. And I put a fair few down. You did it like two trees at a time. It'll probably be a little better. So we need a floor. Um, oh, thank you very much. Or, do we put a layer of rocks on? Let's put a layer of rocks on. Where is that? Oh, that's right there. What? 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 I don't, what? Oh, for fu- And that bit's fine. Um, just want to sort that bit out. Come on, why? 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 What? It's real! What is this game? No, I shall refuse to acknowledge that these walls exist. Come on, like, I don't want... What? what I love is that if you build them, they just look like that. That's precisely how they come up. Right? Uh, yep, yeah, okay. And then we can just be like, hey... Come on! Yeah, just... Yeah, I... What if? I'm gonna, man. What are you? What are you? Oh. No. Oh, all right. Um. God, I used to live in a house like this. Oh, it's just ventilation. It's a fucking hole in the wall. What if I try and build an actual uh, custom wall? Custom wall. 
custom wall. Nice. Come on, just get out. Come on. Let's just get out of that. And if I try and... Okay. Okay, whoop. Well, you get it on the big jobs, right? You don't want to see it. In fact, you hate to see it. Oh, easy. What? Some other bit of... And then... You've just got some fucking... Okay! 40? Yeah, okay. 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 It's fine. Everything fine. Oh my goodness. Well then, here we are. As in the first day. Building the things. Getting the logs. Putting on the, the tunes. The classics. My little tape deck. And just keep it the building challenges. Whoa. Come on, bro. You got these stairs. We got your back. Yeah. And we've got a couple of logs we've got to go get. Which is fine, because I built a raft. A little log collector. I thought it'd be cool if I could build like a scoop, so you just drive into the logs. You just, just sucks them out and puts them in the thing. That'd be cool. That's less cool. Um, yeah. No, no, not you, him. Is that it for the majority of the logs? No, no, no. Put the log in the thing. Pick up the thing. Alright. Alright. Okay. Okay? Hmm. He had some fish, didn't I? Oh, I had all sorts from there. And I assassinated that deer by dropping a tree on it. And, alright, we're good. Yeah, I didn't really want to do this with wood, because it just takes that much longer. That's alright. Remind me not to do that. Um... Right. No, 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 bro. No, but we're good. We're fine. Okay. We're just yeah. Mhm. Mm mhm. And uh, in fact, you know what's up. You know what's up. I'm going to grab some more coffee. That's what's up. I'm going to bear it back, grab some coffee. Kick about, I'll wait, I'll wait three or four minutes.
My jolly goodness, we did it. Is that the one? I think that's the button I gotta press. I should really spend more time getting to understand how Twitch actually works. Thanks for hanging on, my faithful viewer. You're the real MVP. I forgot my phone. My life, BRB. <clears throat> alright, alright. Or okay, just this is the height of preparedness. I'm a very prepared, very professional streamer, free of distractions, streaming is my full-time job, and nothing ever gets in the way. Which is, of course, all completely a lie. But if you can't lie on the internet, then, um... No, I was going to say something clever, but it was probably going to sound inappropriate. We'll just leave it. We'll just leave it. You don't have to lie. Like me, pretending I'm a full-time Twitch streamer. Which is a clever ruse. Both the uh, size of my Twitch stream and the quality of my production may make it appear that I am, in fact, an incredible online personality. But, uh, you know, shockingly, just a regular dude with a normal job, likes playing video games, likes to hang out with people that enjoy those video games, and so we stream it for a bit. Anyway, that's enough about normal real world crap. I think the issue with, with streaming, now that I just said let's, that's enough and I'm still on about it, is that I don't have someone in the real world going, bro, will you just shut the hell up? Because I definitely have a bit of that in the real world. Uh, I don't carry any food with me, which is silly, because I kind of should. Although we've got plenty, plenty of these drinks going on. What do you reckon? Have we got one up here? Oh, yeah? Hey! <laughs> oh, wait. Really? I put katana on a hotkey? I thought it wasn't on a hotkey. Go, Anna! Go, Anna! <laughs> go, Anna! I don't know. They're not called Go, Anna's in this game, nor is Go, Anna the correct lyric to that Toto song. It's it is the Toto song. Jo Joanna? Susanna? Joanna? No. I should put this on YouTube, because guarantee you'll get some angry Toto fan. This is what the lyrics are. This is what it's about. Disrespecting the band. Throw them down there, and we'll head back over there. This way. That's what. Six. That's like five. All right. It's getting a little dark. All right, it's, it's it's getting a bit moody. Moody weather. You know what I mean, right? So. Um, this other tree. 
Because we've got the space. You know what I'm saying? So why not? And we've got the relative safety here. Chuck that tree on here. I know, it's like, you keep making the zip lines, and then you don't really use them for the logs, but they make such a mess, and it's it's disappointing. I remember, I don't think we really had the issue when we did the water fortress, but I, maybe I just didn't stack that many trees up. I think I did, I stacked a fair few. I think they just fell in a, in a really, really good way. They didn't quite land on each other the same way. And certainly a few rolled out, but especially once we had the walls up, we were all good. Run up here with Chuck. I don't know. Two trees down the zip line. Uh, how do we eat this bit? Oh. Oh, why not? Why not this one? It's actually not charging. There we are. Mm. Yep, phone's definitely charging now. Making all that noise. Okie dokie. Oopsie. Sorry, I suddenly thought I should make some original Mortal Kombat sound effects. Finish it. This Twitch is really kind of degraded into the sounds I make while doing housework. And that one, and that one, and oh, that's a little steeper than I remember. And my brain went, don't worry, you manufactured parachutes earlier when you found all the mushrooms. And I was about to jump off, and then I remembered, but I can't do that because this isn't satisfactory. Um, and and none of those none of those things apply. Although I do appreciate when you build the, like the hang glider, the paraglider, whatever it is, in this game, that you can't just like put it in your pocket and carry it around. And there was a part of me that was like, oh, I wish I could just do that, I could just leap off stuff, and it's like, that's the ultimate item, and you don't really have to worry about heights anymore. But it also makes a lot of sense that you can't just fiddle this shit in your back pocket, ignoring the tremendous amount of stuff you fit in your backpack currently. Uh, was that a log that went sailing past? Did I sort of see something earlier? Or are we... Oh, we doing okay. I think we're doing okay. We might actually... Oh, I can't quite sleep it off. Oh yeah? Okay, so... What was that, like two trees? And like a couple from one, a couple from the other. Not quite. Alright, this is this is coming along. Coming along. I like that our building is now big enough to give uh, some sort of sound effect difference. You knew it. I like that. Uh, link, just late. 
of late. And by then we should be out of sleep. Hooray! All right. No. I'm like, oh yeah, I can sleep. Now that's a, that's a fire. That's not sleeping. Chat, I have something to confide in you that's that's bothering me. My cat. We have three cats. One of them went missing several months ago. He was a little bit of a feral thing. He just had that personality. He was abandoned as a kid, and that's how we got him. Um, you know, and if you didn't see him for, say, two days, that's normal. By day three, you always start to go, hey, have we seen the cat? Um, and then, like, by the end of day three, he would always turn up. And he was a real cyclical sort of little dude with his personality. Outdoor cat, doesn't really want to know you, and then it's indoor, and he's, you know, for like a week. Uh, and then he's just indoors every day for a week, and he's on the bed constantly, and it's all cuddles and love. And then, no, stuff you on, I'm outside again. Like, absolutely gone for two, three days at a time, and then you'll occasionally hear me singing the song of my people when I come in to eat something. Um, and that, that's who he was. He went missing, and, you know, check out all the RSPCA, all the... All the Facebook groups, all the rest of it, driving around all the shelters, walking around the neighbourhood all hours of the night. You know, probably hit by a car or something. Shitty. Very, very shitty. I hope, however, he went, if he's gone, it was, like, quick and painless, right? I hope it wasn't like he got a snake bite and was hurting and, and rubbish. So that's very sad, and we've kind of got past that a bit, waking up at every sound and thinking, oh, he's in the house, oh, is that him? What was that tiny noise? Was that him? Um, and we have two other cats, right? And the littlest one, who's much more of a home cat. Of all three of them, he's the one who's like, oh, the other cats have left the house? This is brilliant. I love being the only cat inside. I shall go out occasionally and then complain at the front door until you let me in. Uh, he's gone missing. And of all the cats that you would expect to not go missing, to not go outside for too long. He's definitely the one. And he's been gone. I haven't seen him been gone. I haven't seen him for one day. And that's not necessarily a big deal. He might have just found something interesting. There might just be like a new neighbor's cat. And he's kind of just sitting looking at them and then fell asleep somewhere. Because they can sleep. Well, I think they normally sleep for like 13 hours a day anyway. That's really normal. Um, man, is my anxiety up? I'm just terrified the little dude's not going to come home. And it'll be like, you had three cats. It's like three months later, you've now got one cat. And I'm not a overtly emotional person. Which doesn't mean I don't care, because it's stressing me out greatly. Was that, was that a nosy neighbour that I heard? Was that the little... <laughs> it was. Telling a story about my lost cat. Uh, oh. I mean... Yeah? Guess not in the head. Um, what did you get a mouthful of seawater? Uh -huh. Anyway, that's that's my story about about my, my cat cat related dramas. <laughs> that was a that was a bad impression of you, Mister Cannibal. Uh, well, that's not going to go well for you. Actually, I think that was the noise you make when you die. So are the rest of you going to freak out and run off? Hey! See, we were sliding down at the night time. And I went, 
I just, I sort of saw something and I thought, was that, was that something? And in my brain, I'm like, what would it be? There is nothing that kind of like freaks out over the ocean like that. I thought maybe it was a log and I didn't mention it because all I do in this game is run around and then I'd be like, oh, what was that? I was like, it's nothing. Stop, stop looking at shit. It's not anything, you big dummy. Sorry, turtle. And of course, the one time I don't stop and turn around, it is something. I mean, come on. We got, we got enough sticks. I'm this close to building another rock holder. Sixteen logs. Like four, eight, twelve. Mm -hmm. These ambient sound effects, though. Uh, oh, hey, you grow back. Oh, cute. Come on, fellas. Someone, someone's got to go. Oh, we've got to go backwards. All right, okay. Yep, yep. Honestly, I think I'll do like four. Anything more than that, and it starts to get silly. Two logs just here. Thank you very much. And that's two. There's not a sneaky fifth. There's a sneaky fifth, yeah. Yeah, little, little sneaky, sneaky thing. Okie dokie dokie. So uh, what's happening here? No. Nah. Red Australian expression. Do you want one of these? Nah. Cool. He hoofed and he puffed and he signed an eviction notice. Stop touching my things. It's like seeing kids hang around your car. Like, hey, what are you doing? Being perfectly legal, 100% acceptable pedestrians. They just happen to be near your car when you see them. That's it. We're calling triple O. We're calling 911. Get the police down here. What's up? The damn youths are near my car. Look, I'm sorry one of your friends drowned, right? Swim between the flags. That's what's up. I was swimming with a buddy. And not like I went to the beach with friends and only one of us went swimming. Like two people in the ocean. Don't swim before dawn or after dusk. So no one else can see that you need help. And, and slip, slop, slap, motherfuckers. Wear a hat. You get sunburnt. This isn't Europe where you can just sit outside non-stop and you don't really particularly get a tan, never mind sunburn. It's Australia, you will be dead in minutes. What are you guys fucked off? Have you got away from my car, you damn youths? 
Bloody kids. No good. Stay in school. All right, we'll park a little bit closer. Fucking hell. Give me all that. Is that the mechanic that we saw just then where if one of them dies or if you hurt one of them and there's like only one? Um, it's the mechanic that one or, or a number of them will run away and then they come back with more. Is that what that was? Because that was pretty much the same spot. So we've taken an absolutely beginner's look at game development just because things like programming, they interest me and then pixel art interests me and a few little puzzly games I've always enjoyed and I've always enjoyed creative things and so now therefore the AI of how a lot of this works also very much interests me. Just how did they set up some of these behaviors, when they'll do certain things, how that works out, if they'll do them or not. Um, and we're just not going to talk about the actual rendered pathing of some of these dudes. Although it was probably like end note when it was just like two or three of them. Uh, someone was like, I bet you 50 bucks. You can't sneak a ridiculous bug into this game post-production. They'll be like, oh, you're on, man. And it was like, they'd had a really big day. They're blowing off some steam. Having a few beers. And anyway, I bet I can get, get this going on. I'll get I'll get you your bug. Um, and that's why uh, a bunch of the cannibals will just stop what they're doing and run around in circles for no reason at all. I like to think that's what that was. Like when you work in a really high performing team and like it's a, it's a hectic job so you're really busy all the time and so other teams will be like oh like, look at those results look at how that's going look at all the work they're getting done and then when you actually hang out with that particular team at any particular point they're always just doing dumb shit like how are you guys some of the best in the business when all you do is is write dumbass things on sticky notes and try and hide them on each other How was how was four? Four was one, two, three. Okay. I mean, hey, you know, <laughs> that's seventy-five percent. We're good. That's not bad, right? Better than nothing. Three. Have I got a fourth log somewhere? I sent four down, didn't I? Oh. It'll turn up. They always do. Right? Like my cat. Oh, Jesus. Alright. Come on, bro. Where's my extra log at? Where's my log? Where's my log? Where's my log at? There it is. That makes lots of sense. Free log. Can I reach it? No. No, I cannot. Love me some free logs. Hmm. That still shits me deeply. Like, I'm glad everything just worked, but, hmm. There's nothing on those other islands, right? Like, all the, I mean, you've got the one, like, much, like, the complete other end of the, of the forest, where you get the crossbow. Um, and that's got, you know, like, some crossbow bolts, I think, will spawn there, or respawn there, or some rubbish.
But the other islands, I just, it's been such a long time since I've been to any of them. I did manage once, there's that smaller island, um, so if you, the gap in those cliffs there, there's obviously a body of water there, and to the end of that body of water there's a bit of an island, um, near the chainsaw cave. And I did once remember having a base there and a rabbit spawned there, but I think that's because I was running around on the mainland and a rabbit was spawning, I wasn't killing it, so they were kind of following you in the way that it does. Um, to kind of, I think it's so they don't render too many things all at once, that's a part of why they spawn near you. So the game's not just rendering shit running around that you're not even worried about, or can't even see. Um, but otherwise... Yeah, there's nothing. I don't even think, even at complete furthest end, the last islands, they might get some sticks on them, maybe? But it's really just rocks. Dolphin sound effects. Porpoise noises. The water looks much more inviting once you're in it, right? That's got some real, like, deep, dark, scary ocean vibes going on. Nine logs. I think we got it. And then a floor, and then cut a hole, and then some stairs. And then, what am I doing? And then, we can get back, hey, logs and some change. A little sneaky little log, what are you doing? I'm oh, just resting. Just resting down here. Oh, get clip. Huh. So we'll build that, and we'll put the floor on, we'll cut the hole in, and we'll put some stairs on. And then we'll do like another, it was two that I did there, right? Two lots of the rocks. Um, won't be as many rocks, because we're now doing it a bit smaller. So I wanted to do like a little home base thing, a little outdoor setting, probably some furniture and stuff in the end. We'll probably do like a, a T-shape pier, dock, whatever they call it. Um, as far as the light on top of the lighthouse goes, I was actually really hoping for a bonfire on top of an elevator. But that's not a thing. Can't, can't, uh, I did a bit of creative mode, ran around for a few minutes just to check out what would look best, um, once we get to that point. But it's gonna be a extra tall gazebo, I think. Um, or just the regular gazebo built as high as it goes. I have memories of building that really tall one time and after putting the rope on I still couldn't reach the rope like you just built it too damn tall. Um, so I rocked it out in creative mode. Um, just enough to dick about. Uh, and yeah I managed to build it as tall as I could and I could stick the rope on and I had to jump to get it but I could get the rope. Although I didn't check if I do build the gazebo. All right. Uh, really? Is it like a half? Like, is that going to... I mean, like, that's, that's kind of cool. To have, like, an enclosed dining outdoor, like, alfresco area. That's not what I want, though, bro. Um, you kind of just can't be asked with the 61 logs. Yeah, my. Yeah, is that? Custom floor. No, no, no. 
Guys. Kill it, is that? Come on. Come on. No, no, no. I do is oh why does that why do you refuse come on what is this shit okay okay let's think let's think Gonna I'm sorry, we're we just not gonna do anything. Yet? Okay. Yes. Can I Seriously? Oh we we're just bugging out. We're bugging right out. We uh we've had enough. We don't want you to place any more rocks. Can I place it? Can I build anything? This is okay. All right, stop, stop doing that. Can I build anything right now? Not, not really. Okay, all the blueprints have gone invisible. Can I cancel you out? Now, are you just like spawning on the ocean floor? God, can I sleep? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Look, we'll sleep if that doesn't. Uh... Thing isn't right by the morning. We'll save it. We'll jump out. We'll jump back. See what's up. Hmm. All right. Uh, we'll try exit the main menu before we have to restart the whole jam. Okay. Technical difficulties. Uh, like I don't even have a... It just doesn't... Uh, okay. Okay, I mean, look. I'm not sure what happened. You're not sure what happened. Um... I just want to build some rocks. Wait a minute, was that a... We do that. Okay, can I do that and then... Tidy. Hey. Uh, the edges. Oh. Okay. I still feel like this won't work properly. No, no, up, 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 mm. okay. And then can I do like a one up there? Mm. Mm. Okay, 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 okay. Mm. We got 
Just bullshit over here, okay. Fine. Come on now. It's almost like a real world DIY job, isn't it? Like, yes, I am 100% certain I can probably get that done, no issue. Like, I've never, you know, like, i got to change a washer on a tap. You know, like, it's, it's not a huge deal. I can probably YouTube it, like, the first time you do a, like, the brake light or something. I can definitely, I can definitely probably do that. Um, I just built a fucking, God, oh, I'm so angry with this. And then you get through most of it, right? Like, 80% of the work and it's fine. And then it's like, oh, this one thing's gone terribly wrong and I don't understand. Um, all right, let's just build a little, yeah, little step ladder. You can change the angle of said dangle, and, um, why are you not just, what? The concern, of course. Is A, is that going to be a huge pain to actually try and build? Okay, we'll get there. A lot of hibbity hobbitying around. But once I do build it, can I build a floor on it? And we're just going to have some kind of gap. Which I could probably fill in manually, I guess. Like, can I even get it to just be up there? Probably. Probably once I get up there... I think you can build a floor using the rocks as foundations. That's definitely a thing. Do I only need three of said foundations? Oh, that's cool. Um, I have a whole thing full of rocks just here. Well, let's just grab two more. Two more. You got this. I guess it's why it's called a challenge build. Right? Come on. Come on, bro. You were doing so well before. And uh, some name, some a drink. Hmm. Mm. Num, 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 num. Num. And then you're gonna walk away and then you come back. I mean, it's a flawless experience. Flawless. This better work. Like, I'm not, a, I don't even know what I'm gonna do if I actually get these done. I just built the fucking that one. Beside myself is what will happen. I'll just rage quit. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just let's not worry about what hasn't happened yet. Let's just put a few things together and see what we get. Let's put a few things together and we're going to see what we get. Hypothetically, right now, at this moment, I tried to put a floor on. Uh, yeah, if I just was like, eh, that's yeah, okay, so it's a no-no. Well, for now, right? I mean, it's not even that's not necessarily off the table, and it would kind of be cool to have that bit. And I've seen people build similar things and they put some little pylons up and it looks quite effective it's just a lot of work hmm 
All right, we'll just we'll just keep on keeping on. So it's my thinking noise not being very engaging. Like if that doesn't work, I don't just want to be like, well, that's it, didn't work out. Uh, we just got to think of a different way to tackle the problem. Um, where is you? Where is you, dreaded hole cutter? Steady. Lovely. Uh, let's just get it built. Let's just get the rocks up. And put a floor down great. We'll just say it's ventilation. Um, got rocks there, I just keep forgetting to use them. Rock's done. We'll try and put a floor on. If we get a floor on, tip top. Um, doing it again. Just go and get the ones out of the thing. Oh well, there's one there. Never mind. Because now we're moving into the territory that it's just hard to get there. And without the floor and the stairs, etc, etc. Bit of rain. Thanks for, thanks for that, bro. Go on. Get the last one. Sorry, I'm fading away. I'm completely, completely ignoring my actual stream because now I'm just in problem solving mode for what are we going to do? I can build a floor, great. Um, it'll still annoy me having a gap there. Maybe I can sort out. Like, I, I, even if I can just place a, a regular rock wall and I just fill it in. Um, if uh, we get all this done, it's not damaged, is it? Nothing here has happened, right? Yeah. So if we get all that done and we cannot build a floor, then we will I mean one thing I need to check out. I've got this beautiful idea of putting a gazebo, right? Does the gazebo actually stop at the floor? What? Kind of? Hold up. Yeah. 
Yeah, okay, it does. Like, you know, indirectly. Fine. Because the gazebo is is the, the, the penultimate piece. And then we go and put a, uh, a bonfire on top. Fill it full of leaves and money. And then take a few pretty pictures from a few different angles. I was just really hoping that we could get this a bit taller. It was going to be a bit of a slog, don't get me wrong. But I've never built anything particularly tall before. Uh, you know. I and mean, we can build a floor, it just it comes all the way out here, right? That shits me. Shits me because it's a lot of logs. But then this will shit me. Because this is a lot of work with a lot of rocks for it to not work when we get to the other end. What have we got? Little oh, buddy. Just having a quick quick check on the old steam friends uh, I ran into a dude on reddit last night and uh, he plays the forest and he streams I thought maybe we'd hang out but we'll see what happens no fuss no muss I don't know what that means not a drama it's not a drama bro all right all right, all right, getting there, getting there. It's just positive energy. We don't get stressed about video games. That's what I tell myself. Not true. Not true at all. But it's kind of the definition of, of what trolling was, right? You're getting upset about something that doesn't actually matter. It's offensive, it's bothering me. You have the option to just leave and ignore it. Video game makes me angry when I just don't fucking play. But I want to. Well then whose fault is this? Oh. 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 God, you wouldn't want to live here drunk. Extra rock, eh? Eh? And that one was there. No, okay. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Settle down. Oop. All right, boys. Moment of truth. Uh, moment of rage. Can I? Can I? No. No. On the rocks. On. Uh, was that a was that a moment of you did it you. Oh. <laughs> oh. So we're still building on the rocks. We're just still having the same issue. Are you like can you Is it the foundation that's just ruining you? The game just refuses to acknowledge that there's another floor? Is that a clue? Is that I build a foundation on like another floor. Does the wood Oh, minute. Okay. Uh, um, hmm. 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 All right. Come on. Cancel out. Cancel out. Here we go. Okay. All right. Uh, hmm. You can put a hole in a custom floor. Can you put a hole in a custom foundation? Hold up. 
save the game. Save the game. Come on now. Okay. Uh, custom hole, custom unit. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. And now we have a basement. Um, that I don't want, so. Okay. Uh, in your own time, oh, in your own time, the forest, we're having a, wait for the program to respond, yeah, please, um, uh, we're going to close the program, hang on while Windows sends an error report, no thank you, <sighs> okay, okay, that's fine, it's cool, um, here we go. And we're back in the forest. Um, or are we? Okay. What a conundrum. Shut up phone notifications. Check what's going on in my life. Nothing. Uh... Come on, um, I mean, that's 61 logs that I just don't have time for, and, oh, for the love of, sweet jolly goodness, I don't think I can get rid of. Okay, deep, deep breaths. Deep breaths, deep breaths. Uh, I, uh, mm, what, what are you just stop fucking about and either get taller or don't? I'm so angry. So much rage. Okay. Oh, God. Jim, glad we put those windows in. Uh, so that's right, and then this is going to be so janky and horrible. Um, I mean, I can still kind of use the windows. 46 logs, and then cut a hole in it, and then put some stairs up. Might almost be that that's the solution. We just build the rest of it up like this. Or do we just try and decorate? No, no, uh, you know, that sort of thing a couple times. Um, until we get it to touch there, and then that'll look extra cool. Because that's important, to look cool, right? Especially when you're putting things on the internet. Um, um, God, I need an adult. There's too many decisions to be made. Fuck me. I hate how that looks. How many of these can I put up and will it kind of, kind of match what's going on up here? Right, if I just did like, oh, I'll just sort of stick above, but that's kind of okay. Yeah, you got this. Come on. Come on. I'm going to make it bigger, and then I'm going to make it smaller, and then... No, 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 no. For the love of God. Oh, we had it. There we go. And then I'll cut... Oh. Alright, I need more rocks. Uh, jump down, but don't jump too hard. There we go. 
Okay, okay, okay. Are we committing to this? God, I suppose we are. We've got to build the lighthouse. I mean, I think every build gets to a point where you're not sure if you're going to be happy with how it turns out. I remember being with the, the water fortress. Did get a bit upset with some of the catapults. But that wasn't a great deal. Most of it turned out quite well. I remember being quite chuffed. Oh, for fuck's sake, just come on. And I think I kept constantly saying, oh, I'm really happy with that. It's gone really well. This caused me a bit of heartache. If I'm honest, because then, uh, come on, I don't know how I can... because then what? We build this one up. We build this one up. We get this floor done that I can probably put logs into, probably. And then from the next platform up, we do a floor of foundation or two. And then we do the super tall gazebo. Uh, bedtime? Oh, fuck. I shall express my, myself. Um, my God. Um, uh, uh. Um. Uh. Oh. I'm not angry at the forest, but I am disappointed. I need to jump in and out to try and sort it out, and then I need to close it, open it again. That's cool. We came here for a challenge, and by Jove, are we going to have one? No, no, mm. Just so that on day 100, Megan can fly past and wreck the place. Hey, Moon. Come on, <laughs> just let me build. I just wanna build this way. This is gonna be a grind. It's like there's big, big projects you start, and you just you always get to that point. Found it with uh, with writing. I, I published a couple of children's books, and they're they're really not so bad. They're really not, because it's they're like picture books, right? Um, so you just get a fun little idea going, and then you try and make up a few rhymes around it, and they they work out quite well. Uh, editing gets is always just a, a bit of a struggle, right? Because I mean, when a piece is so small, um, you know, any change you do, and you're like, oh, I've knocked out ten percent of the whole body of work. Um, what are we doing? We'll eat one of them. Nom, nom, nom. I'd eat two of them. Num num num, and then uh, and then we'll have one of those because we need the energy, more energy. Um, but then working on a manuscript for a novel, no matter how much fun you're having, great ideas, things like that, which which is something I've been doing. Not I haven't worked on it for quite a while. It's not like I want to be a full time author. That would be kind of cool, but it's not what I'm working towards. Um, and even then, you just get to points, even when you're like, I've got a great idea for this, this reads really well, really happy, the next really great idea is this bit, I've got to get all the characters there. I've got to get everyone there somehow, so now I need to make up stuff that wasn't a part of my original idea. And everyone, everyone you go to at some point, unless they're really experienced enough to just know better, to know and have faith that they'll get through it. It's just like, why did I start this project? I hate this project. It's not fun anymore. I don't want to do it anymore. It's just work now, except I'm not getting paid. Alright. And that's a little bit 
a little bit like what this lighthouse is doing to me right now. But even just making a decision, I feel better that we'll do that floor. It'll look quite badass. We'll do a couple of floors of uh, custom uh, thingamadoodads. You know what I mean? Uh, I might just swim on over. Dolphin noises. What a stress. What a stress attack. Alright. Rock. Have it your way. Um, just throw a bunch of trees down the zip line. If it makes a big mess. So what? Alright. I don't even have a joke for this situation. A plane crash survivor and a cannibal walk into a bar. The plane crash survivor says, what would you like to drink? And the cannibal kills him and eats him. Alright, needs work. Needs work. My jokes aren't quite funny enough to run for Prime Minister. Am I right, Volodymyr Zelensky? No, 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 no. No, no, not the rock. Not the fucking... Oh, mother of God. The oh, fuck? What was all that about? Steamy and shit? Shut up, Bambi. Sick of hearing about it. Fifty-three logs. Fifty-three logs. Fifty. Is there like one log like down? I don't care. I don't care. We don't really need that out, do we? Um. But yeah. Almost like the AI tells them to freak out when you stand still. Like, if you're standing still, you're probably trying to shoot it. Just doing a drive-by. It's unlikely. Oh, I thought I knocked it down. I thought I killed it. Here we go. Let's see what sort of damage we, we catch on the way past. Don't want to get your lighter out? It's fine. What do we got? What do we got? Hi. You fucking with me right now? God, I'm so angry. I'm so much swearing. Okay. 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 Still gonna be that horrible gap there. Uh, yoink. Boop. And dip. Dup. Dip. Bibbidi boop, and I can't sleep. And no time, and the trees aren't coming back. And oh. Ugh. Hey, hey. Don't, uh, don't vanish on me there, son. Where's the. Alright, there's one over there. Let's, uh. Go! Over here somewhere, right? There we go. There we go. Anyone else? Can anyone say anything? Oh, but, um, all right, I mean, they kind of like exploded in this direction, though, right? Uh, we'll just mosey on over. We'll see what's up. 
Let's see how we go. No, no, we're fine, thank you. Is that one? Alright. Log ho. Is it? Alright, it's almost daytime. Where are we at? Where are we at? Where are we at? Alright. In it. Uh, yoink. What's up? Oh. Alright, alright. Come on. Thank you. Uh, oh, there's one. Oh. Hey, two. Gotta be a little careful as you do get cannibals. Hey! You get cannibals running through here. I don't know how far they're going. Get out of my face, squirrel! Times were, I'd stop what I was doing to kill you. But it's not that time anymore. Check out the moss. I never knew there was moss on the rocks. Uh, we'll give this a moment just for the sun to come up. Oh, I've run out of coffee again! Why does everyone hate me? Okay, okay, okay. Deep breaths, deep breaths. Gonna wait for the sun to come up. We're gonna do a quick scout out. We're gonna try and find a few more logs. And, uh... And everything's gonna be good. Everything's gonna be just fine. Uh, I'm not sure how much longer I'm gonna stream for us. I have a few other things to do. You know, just in my general life. I'm not saying I'm happy about that. But, uh, come on with the sunlight already. But it's just how it has to be, right? We all good for rocks? We all good for rocks. Alright, let's jump back in the boat. And we'll just see what else pops up. The sun will be here any minute now. Or well, Ragnarok happened and we missed it. The great boar swallowed the sun or whatever's supposed to happen with that. Come on, buddy. Uh, I don't think there's much around here. There we are. Uh, yeah, I mean, while we're here, right, we need the logs. Need the sticks? We don't need the sticks. Is that a dude? Or is it just a tiny, tiny tree? It's a tiny, tiny tree. It's not a dude at all. liked to have found a few more logs. Nothing? Anything? Eagle eyes. Looking. Scanning the horizon. For any of those damn logs. Because who needs physics? With logs like these. Alright. Alright, alright, oh god, let's not die of thirst. These logs haven't done something monumentally silly, have they? And just like 
tell me there's no logs like behind over here in the water. So I keep finding logs there and it doesn't make much sense. Doesn't make much sense to me. If they all seem to explode towards me and push me back up the fucking the rope swing. Sorry, zip line. If you call it a rope swing or the ropes or the zip line, people get upset. It's like if you confuse ship and boat. Don't know what the difference is though. Alright, now you are dried, so I should be good to eat you. Yeah, nice. Alright, you know, we're getting there. Slowly but surely. Any other logs? Hey, buddy. Nope. Last chance, place your bets. Ah! Dun 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 Yes! 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 Come on, you can do it, I believe in you. All right, ridiculous log physics and rules. Oh, okay. Everything's coming up roses. Okay, okay. All right. Yep, zop, zip, zip, whoop. Okay, okay, okay. Whew. I'm kind of exhausted. Like, I get it first thing in a Saturday morning too, right? But that was just, that was way too much troubleshooting and then kind of not sure where we want to go, what we want to do. That still really, really annoys me. Um... I'm kind of worn out. I had to make too many decisions. I had to really kind of try and, and work that out. To then just be like, oh, fuck it. I'll just do it that way anyway. Which then, of course, if that was going to be my decision, I would have left it without the rock so that we don't have the gap. But listen to the draft. You can hear the draft. I think that's a height thing, isn't it? Is it a height thing or a way that could just be a weather thing too, right? Um, when you get the windy sound effects. 43, alright, so we'll be down to, hey, hey, what, uh, like 39, fucking, so angry, so much swearing, so frustrated, so angry, so dead, what is that from, uh, Borderlands. My granddaddy always said, wheels are better than heels. He's dead. So come on, catch a ride. That was a great game. Shoot a skag in the mouth for extra damage. What? You don't need to be a better shot. You just need to shoot more bullets. I always liked that character. Cause my grandfather's from Eastern Europe. And he sounds just like that. Oh, I mean, like, I think my family's going to be home any minute, and i got to do stuff, all of which is fine. We're nearly at day 100, which is fine. I just want to get more of this done. Get the floor done. What do we need to get the floor done? Like 10 trees? Let's say like 8 trees, maybe? And get a few fivers. What the hell did I just run into? No. Nope. Well, probably that. Probably that, to be honest. Um. Hey, turtle. My bro, Raphael. last episode we saw his friend uh my friend his bro uh donatello you know how it goes you know how it works 
All right. Oh, he's a bit puffed. He's a bit puffed out. All right. All right. Come on. I think I do that every time. Like every single time he kind of goofs that second swing. I'm always like, come on, buddy. Come on. You can do it. Am I supportive or am I condescending? Probably both. I think that's the best part. You can genuinely be one and be confused for the other. Like, oh, this guy's a tool. I'm sick of hearing about it. Yeah, hey, good for you, buddy. And the dude will be like, oh, thanks. And then someone else is like, hey, that's a really good job. Good work. They're like, oh, you're so condescending. All right. Again, we're going to do like four, and we're going to load up the others. So it's too much of a mess otherwise, but it's that much faster than just running everything down the hill and stacking it on the boat. And I will try very hard to get the rest of the 100 Heads Challenge YouTube video put together, which we didn't do on Twitch. Um, as I finally got myself sorted with some fun on a bun video editing software. Um, just got like a 90 day free trial, so we'll see how we go. Um, if it works, great. And if people like it, great. Not that my YouTube channel really has much going on, but sort of like one of my videos had like 25 views, which I get it, like compared to any sort of professional level is nothing. But the fact I'm not doing anything with them, right? I'm just putting them there. And they're just like my Twitch streams. That's it. Um, to actually have like some people look at it and go, oh, hey, what's this? What are they doing? That's something that interests me. Uh, you know, it makes me happy. So maybe if we put a little bit more effort in. I had a nice comment from, from someone. I have no idea who. Uh, they were like, hey, this is great. Keep it up. It was something like that. And I was like, ah. Oh. I'm all right. I'm glad. I'm glad someone's enjoying the challenges. And then maybe if we get into a situation where people like the YouTube stuff, uh, if they like the sort of edits I do, uh, you know, not not saying that I don't need to improve, but that's only going to happen with experience. Then maybe we can use Twitch to just grab footage for things. Hang out with the stream, chit and chat, and then later on dust up the elder. Uh, we'll just uh, dust up the footage, dust off the footage, tidy up the footage, improve, uh, and then put it on YouTube and see what happens. See if people like it, and that'll be cool because I like it. I enjoy video editing haven't done it in quite some time but I studied it at school and I always loved it and I was doing it for about an hour yesterday with this new bit of software that I didn't know how to use that's after about three days of trying to sort out like codecs and shit and having converters and spending like an hour or two getting my video codec converted from a pre-recorded thing and I'm like no this can't be like all right something's not working out for me here and everyone's saying, oh, this will work like spot on for Twitch videos, and it's not. It's going to work spot on for MP4, and it's not. Um, I just went, instead of trying to troubleshoot the heck out of it, just get a different video editor. Uh, and I did, and it worked really well. Am I interested in spending like $100 a year on it? Kind of no. Oh, hey, any fish in the trap? Oh, not today. Fuck's sake. Um, but they let you break it down at like a $10 a month subscription thing I know when I used to do IT and social media management for small businesses I got most of the Adobe suite on like a subscription which is pretty rad because you still get all the updates and stuff which I think you only get if you buy like the super pro like $2,000 edition um, alright there they go Alright, Twitch. 
I'm going to leave it there, my beautiful friends. Thank you so much for signing in and putting up with me and my, my work. Peace and love from your boy, Abacus. Speak soon.